What up, people? This is the FL Studio 20 How to Collab tutorial. So the first thing that we're going to do is get our collab sound. So in this situation, it's just an MP3 uh, that my friend sent me. And uh, we're just going to drag it in there. Now, I think he likes to do beats at uh, 70 BPM. So it's always good to know the BPM of the beat you're trying to work with before you even start. I mean, I don't know if this is even 70 right here. He says he likes to work at 70, but this kind of doesn't even sound like it. So if, if you're not sure what the tempo is, go to the sound like this and then detect tempo. 75.438, you see what I'm saying? You might have actually done it at this page. Oh, this is a weird beat right here already. So uh, this is collabing in a nutshell. Okay. I'm gonna just try to add a melody on top of it and see if that like makes it any better. Uh, we're also going to bring this entire sound to the mixer. So we're going to put it at 1. And we're going to throw some random effect on it. You know, we can do a lot of different things. But say we just wanted to, like... And I've seen great beats being made like this. Say we just wanted to put in half speed. So, I mean, this is all collabing. This is all a part of the collabing process. So, say we just hate the rest of this, too. Just like. We're gonna zip, we're gonna clip it with this thing. This can always be hard to do for the top track. I'm just gonna cut this out. I mean, this is collabing on a beat. Maybe not the best example. At this point, it almost just seems pointless that it's even there. And when it gets like that. This is it again. This is literally a beat somebody sent me, and at this point, it's like a totally different beat. So, you collab however you want, you know what I'm saying? That's that's the bottom line of collabing. There's no real like rules to it. I mean, you gotta do the files right, but like the whole goal is to make the song better or the beat better. I wasn't a huge fan of the beat, no disrespect, Devante. So we start off like this. So we screwed that part up a little bit. Okay. Copy a part. Control A, Control B. So, I don't know what type of progress we're actually making here, but this is still technically a collab beat. It's 
probably isn't even the right note. If ever that happens, just play it. See how I just recorded it in there? Uh, this isn't the best. But, uh, you see what we're getting at. We're still collabing. I mean, this is still a collab. Isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? You see what I'm getting at? This isn't like typically, this isn't like an unusually great beat. But like, there's a butt. So I, I do like these slower paces because it's easier to add the kick snare. I swear that sounded right in my head.
So we're still collabing on this beat. I mean, it's pretty much over. You can stop watching. I mean, you could have stopped watching like 10 minutes ago, really. Silent Hat is making a comeback. any a little bit so yeah that's how you collab on a beat fo studio 20 thanks for watching guys stay tuned for more uh we'll have some super cool vids in the future but yeah i mean this is a collab beat i can't wait to send this back to him he'll be like dude like this doesn't sound like the original beat at all i'll be like it's in there Y'all my witness, so peace out.